You know, we think we're a lot better than the way we've been playing. Uh, sometimes with 15, 16, 17-year-old kids, it's hard not to play down to the competition once you start start beating them pretty good. So uh, we just need them to teach them how to stay focused. And, and we want to get ready to where we're able to play for four quarters instead of you know being done at halftime. And, uh, and soon enough, we'll be playing teams that it's going to require a full four-quarter effort to win. Ready for another run at a state title. Last year, the Yuma Catholic Shamrocks fell one game short of winning a fourth state title under head coach Red Stallworth. Yuma Catholic fell to Snowflake 38-14. Now, it was the only loss of the season for Yuma Catholic. Now, Stallworth knows every year is different. Offensively, the Shamrocks will be potent again with a good receiving core, a good quarterback, and ground attack. Defensively is where Coach Stallworth feels Yuma Catholic will be very strong. Defensive ends Jackson Jones and Justin Erath are back to wreak havoc around the edges. The linebacking core is also back, and if there's a weakness, it's the offensive line where four of the five starters are brand new. Our defense is better than last year. I think we're much more physical and faster on defense this year. Offensively, I think that we're better in some parts, but again, you know, we're not putting our line down because they are giving us effort and they are trying and, and doing some good things, but um, they're just green. Our offensive line hasn't seen a lot of reps, the guys that are out there uh, together. So we're just working on getting them uh, seasoned up. And uh, if they can, and it depends on how they improve through the course of the year, then we could definitely make a run at it. The Shamrocks are 2-0 on the season and have outscored their opponents. Get this, 109 to nothing. The Shamrocks' home opener is this Friday night against the Coolidge Bears.